that's the uh, primer done. And uh, that primer. Okay, so what I'll do next is uh, start with uh, painting the underside colour. Inside the engine, get all those coloured up. And the underneath colour, which we'd see grey to RAF <coughs> XF eighty three. So going to paint it up in that, and uh, I'll come back and see how it uh, how it looks. Okay. One thing I was going to tell you about is um, the main part of the camera had a seam line on there. Um, there's a very good uh, tutorial on Flora models about uh, how to get rid of that. Basically, it's not used lots of fine sanders. Start off with a fine, ordinary one across the uh, line and slowly work up to one of the polishes on there. And hopefully, when it's uh, Take the cover off it, uh, all this uh, masking tape off it looks all nice and clear. Um, but anyway, the seam line gone uh, on there, so we'll see what it's like when we take all the uh, masking off. Okay, so I'll see you in a few minutes. With this bit, I just thought I'd show you a bit of the uh, spraying I do. Uh, it's not very interesting, this place is 14 minutes of it, uh, so I'll uh, speed it up a bit. Um, if I want to fast forward through it, uh, it will be no problem. So, uh, sit back and enjoy the spraying.
the under side painted and the air vents put in. I think I've got a tiny idea of uh, putting them on after. See the radiators in there. This is covered quite well. I have to do those mask off all these areas and I can start on the top half. So I think we'll do that in the, uh, the next clip. Okay, see you in a minute too. Okay, in this part I've sprayed the grey on the whole of the upper side and masked off with white tack and lots of tissue and masking tape uh, to do the camera pattern. And this is after I've done the uh, green part of the camo and uh, lots of masking in a nice big pile there for you. Okay, and uh, we'll this bit here. It's a nice close up there for you as well. There we go. Looks pretty good, I think. So here we are, that's the uh, camera pattern just on there. And the underside, got the wheels in. Wheel there, I'll paint it up. And I've put the uh, guns in and gun ports. I think it really works because there are some decals for these parts. Um, but I kept them off and paint, painted them red, fitted them after. But I think that looks much better. So I've uh, put a few bits and pieces in. The uh, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> the fuel cap. I thought so. If I'm not going to put anything like the uh, the aerial antenna in, or uh, all the bits and pieces that fit on the bottom, because while I'm weather in it, which I'll show in the next uh, part. Um, I'm planning to knock them off. So I think that's come out really well. It looks a bit shiny and clean at the moment, but uh, I'll do a bit of weathering on it. Uh, nothing too bad. Uh, just probably a dark wash over it and uh, see how that comes up. Okay, so we'll leave it there and uh, see you in the next part. <laughs> 